Alright guys, welcome to today's play of the day. And we are in the Washington Redskins playbook today. And the play we're going to be going over is the shotgun bunch offset, deep dig, skins deep dig. We like to flip the formation uh, just for that motion snap that we've talked about so much this season off the drag. Uh, but this is in the Redskins playbook. And what we like to do with this is there's only really one adjustment that, that we like to make. We like to put A.J. Green on a smart routed out route. Uh, the reason we like to put him on that smart out is is so that we have the spacing across the field. Now, one thing you can do, I like to leave Bernard on that little uh, little hitch, little kind of underneath route, and here's why. If they are in like a cover three, watch what happens. You see how that out route is still kind of open, even though there's no flat over there. Um, but then if they're in like a purple zone situation, watch what happens. You see how Bernard's going to slip out on the outside. Going to get us a nice little spot against the zone. So I just wanted to show that real quick off the back. That's why I like to do the, the deep blue now, or the, the little blue route. Now what you, you can also put him on a streak. And a streak's actually really good too um, against cover three if I remember. They should still hold that flat zone. And you see there it didn't really hold it down. And that's because the safety is in the flat and not like the linebacker. So when that's occurring, we can just sneak this route out, out of the backfield to Bernard. And that's just a, a read you're going to have to make uh, based off of what we have going on here. But anyway, that's what we've got here. Now on the left side, this is what we really like to do. We like to motion Jones out and motion him back in two steps. Against two men under, we like to bullet pass that up. And you see it's a pretty effective route against two men under. And that's one reason we really like this play. Um, now, if you, if you know anything about me, I like to only have one or two routes that beat two man under uh, because I like to beat zone with my other routes. Uh, so our other route that beats two man under is the out route to AJ Green. Um, another route that beats two man under on this play here uh, is this route to Tyler Eifert, but it's very quick. You have to throw it quick, like right there as he cuts back. And then uh, I'm working on this little user catch here, and I don't know if it'll work for you guys on the video. You may mess around with it on your own in practice mode. But this user catch to Hawkins, um, obviously you may put someone other than Hawkins there, but this user catch is you're just going to cut. Let me, let me see if I can get a bigger guy in there because I think it actually is pretty effective because it was working for me in the beginning of the season. And the reason that I like this user catch, we'll just put Gresham there. The reason that I like this user catch is because it's very good against cover zero as well um, because you can just lob it over the top. So, But anyway, we like to pass lead it up, click on, and we like to swerve him from, we like to swerve him and swerve the stick from 2 o'clock to about six o'clock and uh, that's kind of the motion now you don't want to rely on this this is just kind of something cute if you want to um, but swing him around there and it's not working too good for me here uh, we'll just get this out of the way there you see that's what the potential you see the potential of it and uh, that's all I really wanted to kind of give you an opportunity to see is that it is it is something that you can use but it's not it's again it's not something to rely on it's just if they per, perhaps use her. And now what's going to happen, what's really cool, guys, is this. The only way that they can stop, and we're going to back the ball up for this example, but the only way that they can stop the route to Jones is to drop a purple zone over there. Okay, so they have to drop a purple. So they're going to drop Mateu here in a purple zone. Now watch what happens out of two men under. Because this is, again, it, just in case we're, we're playing two-man under. You see that? Now you have that lob streak over the top to Gresham. Okay? Now that's essential because now it gives us, now, now we're scheming beyond it. So now they drop a purple over there. They drop the safety over to the left side to kind of still contain. Um, to to kind of still contain. And let me show you what happens if they drop a purple. Let's just show you. You see how you could split them still? So it is a very effective user catch. Now, let's take a look at this against like a cover three, for example. Against a cover three, watch what happens. You see, you're going to hear it's even more of a quick snap throw because he's he can get out there. So we that's why there's that's why it's a, it's crucial that against off coverage you you actually read. You have to make a read here. Does the guy go to the flat? Does he not? If a guy does go to the flat, like if it's a cover three, so a guy goes to the flat in cover three, but look, the seam is wide open to Gresham. You see that? So that's another thing that you have um, against cover three. 
Now then again, moving forward, if we don't like the streak against cover three and we don't like this route on the left, well, we always have this out route against cover three. And even furthermore, like I said in the beginning of the video, if we don't like the out route against cover three, well, then we have this little slip route to Bernard. You see how it's going to get in a nice little space. And you can put him on a streak too to just to make it make it even better in my opinion because I really... I. I was at the beginning of the year using the blue route, but I like the streak a little better because it's a little more consistent. And then against two men under, I think the streak actually gets open. Pass it to the inside, and you see that the streak against two men under is open as well. So this is just a very dominant play. They're going to have to adjust to stop it. Uh, what's really going to win you a lot of games, though, is the way that the streak and that dig route work off each other. You see how the user catch can happen in zone, and that's what that's why I was trying to drive home, and I kind of did a poor job of it uh, with my user skill. But if they go outside, you have this user catch to Gresham all day. Now, another thing is that you might see here is if, for example, sometimes you'll see guys who will call two men under, and they may show blitz. And so they'll bring the safety down like this or whatever. Well, in this situation, you show blitz. The Gresham route may not be open, but that pass lead up is open. And, of course, you got to click on a little bit sometimes to make the play. But let me, let me get this right here. Let's bring this guy down in the box. And so we come out. And so now we have even more yardage to gain on that user catch. So there's all sorts of ways you're beating the defense, but what's really nice about this formation is the run audible down is a read option out of an offset formation, thus making that run Bernard over effective. If you guys want to see uh, someone who runs the read option really good, you might check out Ryan Dykes' YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Dykes, and I think he actually likes to use uh, the Washington playbook. I've been using the Washington playbook a lot uh, at the beginning of PS4, and I kind of went away with it because uh, I was getting so only so, solely into the bunch. Um, and I kind of started to get more into Arizona, but this uh, this read option is very effective, guys. And and when you use that in combination with this little user catch out here, it makes this a very difficult play to defend. And the really key part is that it beats two men under, which is the most popular defense in Madden 25. I hope this video was beneficial. If it was, please leave a like rating below and comment on what part of the video you guys like the most, what part of this play is your favorite, why you may use this play. Remember, it's in Washington's playbook. And also, guys, uh, just leave a comment and engage with me. Talk with me about your favorite play to beat two men under in the game. Thanks for your time today. Again, I hope this video is beneficial, and we'll see you guys later.